Hey, coins collectors, welcome to my channel Coins Heritage. If you are new on my channel, please subscribe and click on bell icon for more informative videos about coins. Did you know that the 10 pence 2008 UK coin holds a fascinating history and is worth in millions to collectors today today such as the coin's design, historical significance, and current value? In this comprehensive video, we'll delve into the intricate design elements, unravel the historical context surrounding its minting, discuss its collectability and value, and uncover the enduring appeal of this iconic piece of British currency. Today, we're diving into the world of modern British coinage with a close look at the 2008 UK 10 pence coin. We'll explore its design, the historical context of its creation, and its value today. Let us get started. First, let us talk about the design of the 2008 UK 10 pence coin. The obverse of the coin features the fifth and most recent portrait of Queen Elizabeth II which was introduced in 1998. This portrait, designed by Ian Rank Broadley, is notable for its more mature depiction of the Queen, capturing her in her later years. The inscription around the Queen reads Elizabeth II DG Rank FD, which stands for Elizabeth II, by the grace of God, Queen, Defender of the Faith. This phrase reflects the Queen's dual role as the head of state and the head of the Church of England. Now, turning to the reverse side, you'll see a section of the Royal Shield of Arms, a design that was introduced in 2008 as part of a major redesign of the UK's coinage. The shield design is spread across six coins, from the one penny to the fifty pence piece, with each coin displaying a different segment of the shield. The 2008 10 pence coin features the top right section of the shield, which includes the second and third quadrants of the royal coat of arms. These quadrants represent the Lion of England and the Harp of Ireland, symbolizing the unity of the United Kingdom. The 2008 10 pence coin is composed of cupronickel, an alloy consisting of 75% copper and 25% nickel. It has a diameter of 24.5 mm and weighs 6.5 grams. The coin's silver-colored surface and solid construction make it a durable piece of currency that is both functional and aesthetically pleasing. To fully appreciate the 2008 10 pence coin, we need to understand the historical context in which it was introduced. The year 2008 was a time of change and modernization for British coinage. The Royal Mint undertook a significant redesign of the coinage system to better reflect the UK's contemporary identity. The new designs, created by graphic designer Matthew Dent, were chosen through a public competition. Dent's innovative approach linked the coins together through the Royal Shield, creating a cohesive visual narrative across the UK's coinage. This redesign marked a departure from the traditional, more static designs that had been in use for decades. It was a bold move by the Royal Mint to create a modern, unified identity for the nation's coins while still honoring the historical significance of the Royal Coat of Arms. The 2008 UK 10 pence coin was minted at the Royal Mint in Lantry Son, Wales. The Royal Mint, with over 1,100 years of history, is one of the world's leading mints, renowned for its precision and craftsmanship. In 2008, the Royal Mint produced millions of 10 pence coins as part of the new coinage system. This coin, like others from the series, was produced to high standards to ensure durability and widespread circulation. While the 2008 10 pence coin doesn't have any major varieties, it is still a significant piece for collectors, especially those interested in modern British coinage. Coins that have been well preserved in uncirculated condition can be particularly valuable. Now, let us talk about the collectability and value of the 2008 UK 10 pence coin. Like most modern coins, its value is largely dependent on its condition. Coins that have been in circulation typically hold a value close to their face value, 
especially since the coin is still in active use. However, coins in uncirculated or near mint condition can be worth slightly more to collectors, particularly those looking to complete a set of the 2008 coinage series. A 2008 10 pence coin in pristine condition might fetch a small premium, particularly if it's part of a complete set. The 2008 10 pence coin is especially appealing to collectors of modern British coinage. Its role in the Royal Shield series makes it a key piece in any collection focused on the new era of UK coins introduced in 2008. When collecting modern coins like the 2008 10 pence, look for coins with sharp details, a clean surface, and no signs of wear or damage. Professional grading can also provide assurance of a coin's condition and help establish its value in the numismatic market. Before we wrap up, let us dive into some fun facts and trivia about the 2008 10 pence coin and the Royal Shield design. Did you know that the 2008 redesign was the first major change to UK coinage since the decimalization in 1971 Matthew Dent's design won out over thousands of other entries in a public competition, showcasing the power of creative innovation in numismatics. Another interesting fact is that if you collect all the coins from the 2008 series and arrange them together, they form a complete image of the Royal Shield. This was a unique and creative approach that set the 2008 series apart from any previous coinage. Here is a quick trivia question, which other UK coin was introduced in 2008 alongside the new designs? The answer is the £2 coin featuring the 200th anniversary of the abolition of the slave trade, another significant moment in British numismatic history. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting out, Preserving your coins is essential to maintaining their value. Proper handling and storage can make all the difference in keeping your coins in top condition. For the 2008 10 pence coin, consider using protective holders or cases to prevent exposure to air and moisture, which can cause tarnishing and wear. Always handle your coins by the edges to avoid leaving fingerprints or other marks that could reduce their value. And there you have it a detailed look at the 2008 UK 10 pence coin. Whether you're a collector or just interested in the fascinating world of coins, this piece is a wonderful example of modern British numismatics. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, leave a comment with your thoughts or questions, and subscribe to our channel for more in-depth explorations of coins from around the world. Thanks for watching and happy collecting.